Hi guys, today I will explain how to install WordPress on Builder with a free SSL certificate in less than 5 minutes. Stay tuned. Ok, the first step is to create an account on Builder. If you don't still have an account, you can make one with my link that I'll leave in the description, which has a coupon of 100 bucks to use on Builder. Once you're in Builder, you have to deploy a new server. Here select Cloud Compute. The server location will depend on your audience. It's always convenient to choose the location closest to your target audience to make it work faster. In server type, you must select 64-bit and Debian, and the last version. Also, you should select a size for your server. Remember that you can upgrade the server size at any time. Just type a name for the server and deploy the server. Once the server is already created, you have to point the DNS of your domain to the server. For this, you have to copy the server address and go to your domain. In my case, I have it in Namecheap, but it's similar to the other domain providers. Now you have to look for the DNS section. And here you must add an A record. And in address, you should type your IP of the build to server. In hostname, type at. In some other providers, you should leave this field empty. Then create another one with www in hostname and the same address. And now you have to delete all the other DNS that come with the domain by default. Once you change it, you must wait at least for 20 or 30 minutes before continuing with the following steps. This is to ensure that the DNS was changed. To be completely sure if your DNS was changed, you need to go to whatsmydns.net and enter your domain. Here you should see the new IP. Now we go back to Builder and go to the server. Click on the console. Enter the username and password listed on the server. You're gonna find it here. Now we have to install WordDops, which is a tool to install WordPress easily. To do this, you need to enter this command that I'm gonna leave you in the description. It will ask for a name and an email. And now, you have to install the site. To do this, you should type this and replace example.com with your domain. And voila, you already have WordPress installed with SSL certificate. Here you will find the username and password to log into WordPress. And that's it. See you in the next video.